So Ian, a good 3-0 win today, keeps you top of the table. How do you feel from your performance today? I'm pleased, I'm pleased for the boys because it, was a, it wasn't it was a game that was a free-flying football game. Um, we like to get the ball down and pass it and uh, the conditions didn't allow us today. So we had to find another way of winning and uh, we did that today and I'm, I'm, I'm really proud of the group that we, we, we ground out a win against a team that I think we're in a little bit of a false position today, at the moment and uh, they've got some good players and um, I'm pleased that we, we shut them out today. I really am. Uh, Marriott continues his hot streak scoring. Uh, how important is his goals for you this season? Oh, massive, massively. Um, he's been, he, he's been, he's, his work rate as well, not just the goals, but his whole work rate. Him and Gashi up there have been tremendous for us. They lead the line for us really well and gets up the park. Uh, and they feed off well off each other, you know, the big man, small man uh, combination. So, But he's, he's deadly in front of the goal. Any little type of half a yard he, he ain't afraid to shoot and uh, his goals have been really instrumental in where we are in the league at the moment you've got a number of injuries at the back but you've got four clean sheets on the bounce how important is that been to you as well it's massively massively as a football club we've we've always you know blessed ourselves on clean sheets and, and grown um, so t t to get a little run going is good I mean it's, it won't last forever because this league doesn't let you let them, doesn't let you keep clean sheets that often but now we've been good we've been good because we're missing a couple of big centre halves back there as well and uh, the people especially Ross Barrows who's gone back in there has fitted in really well that's good uh, you've got the cup game against Dover next week is that a welcome distraction for you yeah it will be uh, it's a hard task really hard for us uh, hard challenge for us but we'll look forward to it because we're, we're playing with a lot of confidence at the moment uh, so we look forward to the challenge, but we're under no illusions how hard it, it will be. Uh, they were a good, really good side, well-established conference side, so it's going to be a hard game for us, but we're, we're, we're looking forward to it. And where are your views for Kingsland this season? Do you think they can continue at the top? Or well, just it's, every game that comes? Yeah, it's, it's, it's an old cliche, one game at a time, but it's, it's, we're, we're punching way above our weight at the moment, but um, while we're, we're doing it, we'll we're, we're, we're enjoy the ride. Uh, and all I ask these players is that we're competitive in every game. And at the moment, they're, they're going on, on and beyond of what, what you know, what the expectations were. Um, the expectations was just to stay in the league this year. So uh, I think we might have enough points to stay, to stay up there. So that'd be good. Yeah. And uh, with your defensive, obviously your injuries, are you looking to bring anyone in? No, no, not at the moment. Uh, we're we're hoping that the the, the the boys that are out come back soonish. Um, I know we've got lots of games over the Christmas period, so it's really important that they come back. They're close. I think they're about two or three weeks away. So once they come back, we'll have good defensive cover all the way through. Congratulations on the win and your manager of the month. Oh, thank you. Yes. Best thank of luck you. next week. Top man. Cheers. Thank, thank you. you.